Uh, Mark's a great uh, father figure for the kids. As soon as, as soon as he comes home, he likes, he changes his persona and he becomes a, a real daddy. He brought in a new kind of culture, which I would say we were familiar with in the black and white in papers. He's got a very uh, questioning mind, I think. He's, not, he's never happy with, with answers. He wants to prove things and find things out himself and um, yeah, make improvements, you know, improve the world. On one hand, I, I know quite a bit about India. That came from traveling here before. Uh, and also my parents who have traveled extensively in India. So uh, I, had a, I had a slightly richer view perhaps than an average uh, European. But he is, he is quite artistic and he likes to, uh, he likes to draw a lot for Lauren. And uh, yeah, it's another side of him that people probably don't see at work, I don't think. Well, steel and metals are a very fascinating material. There's not a single society worldwide that does not use metal. Look around you in your day-to-day -day life. Everywhere we are using metals. And many of the things we use day daily are actually produced via metal tools, etc. So it's a very important material. But at the same time, uh, if you see how steel is being made, it's a large industry with high temperatures, massive processes, massive cranes being moved, etc. When I was a student um, so many years ago, when I saw this industry, it really excited me. Now, the size of the industry and how large things are used, over time get used to it. But the, the fire, the heat, the temperatures, that's something very primordial. You never get used to it, that continues to excite. I feel that today um, green thinking is receiving a lot of attention. We need to work on the environment, we need to reduce our CO2 emissions, we need to work on climate change. So ultimately any new technology is a story of human endeavour, a story of inspiration and achievement and that's what makes it so exciting. Any innovation is a creative process. Inventing new technology is all about creation. So it starts with inspiration, then a long struggle and ultimately hopefully achievement. So these are really the, the technologies that will save humanity and will save this planet. And they are far more important than the gadgets you have in your pocket.